Hi, I'm Dave Roscoe. It has been reported that roughly 80% of Pi Network participants have never read the project's white paper. As a result, many don't fully understand Pi Network's vision and goals, leading to confusion when they realize that up to 90% of their mind Pi is locked for three years. Some users mistakenly label Pi Network as a scam when in reality, Lockups are a crucial part of its long-term strategy to create a stable, sustainable ecosystem and manage liquidity. Those familiar with Pi Network know that lockups have been part of the plan from the beginning. In this video, I'll explain why Pi lockups exist, how they work, and why they're essential to Pi Network's success. If you've been frustrated by your locked up Pi, this will help you see the bigger picture and understand how it benefits the entire community. Pi Network's lockup mechanism lets users voluntarily lock a portion of their Pi for a set period, offering benefits like increased mining rates and greater network stability. Here's how it works. One, lockup options. Users or pioneers can choose how much Pi to lock and for how long, with a minimum lockup of two weeks. Two, mining rate boost. The more Pi you lock and the longer the duration, the higher your mining rate boost, allowing you to accumulate more Pi over time. Three, reduced circulating supply. Lockups limit how much Pi is immediately available for transactions, which helps stabilize the network and reduce volatility. Four, on-chain lockups. After migration to MindNet, lockups are enforced by smart contracts in the Pi wallet, making them immediate and binding, with boosts applying in the next mining session. Many users get frustrated when they realize they can't unlock their Pi after migration often because they didn't adjust the default lockup settings before migrating. By default, Pi Network sets 90% for three years, but this setting can be changed prior to migration. Once a user's Pi migrates to mainnet, lockups cannot be reversed or modified until the selected period expires. This isn't a Pi Network policy. It is a fundamental part of blockchain mechanics. Pi Network operates on a blockchain ledger, which is designed to be immutable, meaning once a transaction is recorded, it can't be altered or undone. One, smart contracts enforce lockups. When you lock Pi, a smart contract ensures that the terms are automatically enforced. Since smart contracts are self-executing, there's no way to change or cancel them before they expire. Two, blockchain is decentralized and immutable. Unlike traditional banks where transactions can be reversed, blockchains don't have a central authority to override smart contracts. Lockup transactions are permanently recorded and verified, ensuring fairness and security. Three, prevents market manipulation and promotes stability. Lockups control how much Pi enters circulation, preventing mass sell-offs that could destabilize the market. Allowing users to freely unlock Pi at any time would defeat the purpose of a sustainable economy. Since lockups can't be changed after migration, it's important to adjust your settings before transitioning to mainnet. Here's how. Check and modify your lockup settings. Open the Pi Network app, go to lockup settings, and choose a percentage and duration that suits your needs. If unsure, consider a lower percentage or shorter duration to keep more Pi available for use. Remember, the minimum duration is two weeks and 25% of your migrated Pi. Understand that lockups are optional. The default 90% for three years is just a setting. It is not mandatory. The longer and higher your lockup, 
the bigger your mining rate boost, but it's your choice. Plan ahead. If you didn't change your settings before migration, your lockup is final until it expires. Only lock what you are comfortable committing, keeping some pie liquid for flexibility. Many users feel frustrated when they can't unlock their pie, but this is not a pie network rule. It's how blockchains work. Lockups are enforced through smart contracts, making them permanent and irreversible until the selected period ends. This prevents manipulation, ensures fairness, and helps create a stable pie economy. Understanding how pie lockups work and why they're permanent is crucial to making informed choices before migration. Take control of your settings, plan ahead, and align your lockup choices with your goals. Before joining Pi Network, it is important to understand its vision, mechanics, and long-term strategy. A lack of knowledge should not be mistaken as a flaw of the project, especially when all the information is freely available. Spreading misinformation or calling Pi a scam due to misunderstandings only hurts the community by discouraging adoption and trust. An informed community is a strong community. Remember, the success of Pi Network starts with you. Let's build this future together. Pi to the moon. Peace.